After a long back and forth between members of the Paso Robles Joint Unified School District, a decision was made for the soon to be displaced Georgia Brown Elementary School kids. I'm Dylan Foreman covering your community in Paso Robles as emotions ran high Tuesday evening. Peterson, no. Williams, aye. Hogan, aye. Williams, Nathan, aye. In a 5-2 decision, the district opted to merge the Georgia Brown Dual Immersion School kids with Lewis Middle School, converting it into a kindergarten through 6th grade school, while Flamson Middle School would absorb the 7th and 8th grade kids from Lewis. According to Assistant Superintendent of Business Services Brad Pulowski, the decision came down to two factors. I think though that particular piece on the facility side really kind of helped drive some of that um, decision. Flamson was built originally as a high school and subsequently became a middle school, while Lewis was originally built to accommodate an elementary school. But there was also another reason. When you look at the, the cost to improve facilities too, um, cost and option two was lower. Quite a bit lower. The proposed facility changes were drastically different with the cost and option one to move Georgia Brown kids to Flamson, 27 and a half million, while the agreed upon option two far less at over nine and a half million. But regardless of those two points, for some, it's a tough pill to swallow. The number of teachers whose assignments are going to change drastically, and that's a little bit unnerving. So I think you can kind of feel that on our campus. Um, but at the same time, there's a lot of opportunity coming from this change. There were still other factors at place, some of which were emotionally charged, and now parents and teachers at Lewis are forced to embrace change. Uh, this has been a real family for me and for others over the almost the past decade, and that is something that I'm um, uh, that's going to be difficult to let go of. And it's going to be really hard for them to have to uproot and come to Flamson. Um, so I know that there was just a lot of mixed feelings that everybody had. For Flamson principal Audra Carr and science and robotics teacher Justin Ward, there is optimism that the change will end up in the best interest of the kids, parents, and staff for all of the schools involved. I think this is a lot of opportunity coming for us now too. Now we're really just trying to focus on bringing everybody together and making it a unified welcome family that we've had here at Flamson for the last five years. The next steps for the district are to help both Flamson and Lewis Middle Schools transition into the 2024-2025 school year with adjustments to classrooms, redesigns, and schedules. Here in Paso Robles, I'm Dylan Foreman, KSBY News.